Philippians chapter 3 As to the rest, my brothers, rejoice in the Lord. Indeed, it is not tiresome to me to write to you the same things, and for you is sure. Look out for the dogs, look out for the evil workers, look out for the mutilation. For we are the circumcision, who are serving God by the Spirit, and glorying in Christ Jesus, and having no trust in the flesh, though I also have cause of trust in the flesh. If any other one thinks to have trust in flesh, I more. Circumcision on the eighth day, of the race of Israel, of the tribe of Benjamin, a Hebrew of Hebrews, according to law, a Pharisee, according to zeal, persecuting the assembly, according to righteousness that is in law, becoming blameless. But what things were gains to me, these I have counted loss because of the Christ. Yes, indeed, and I count all things to be lost because of the excellence of the knowledge of Christ Jesus, my Lord, because of whom I suffered loss of all things and count them to be refuse, that I may gain Christ and be found in him, not having my righteousness, which is of law, but that which is through faith from Christ, the righteousness that is of God by faith, to know him and the power of his resurrection and the fellowship of his sufferings, being conformed to his death, if anyhow I may attain to the resurrection of the dead. Not that I already obtained or have already been perfected, but I pursue if I also may lay hold of that for which I was also laid hold of by Christ Jesus. Brothers, I do not reckon myself to have laid hold of it, but one thing I do, indeed, forgetting the things behind and stretching forth to the things before, I pursue to the mark for the prize of the high calling of God in Christ Jesus. As many, therefore, as are perfect, let us think this, and if in anything you think otherwise, this also will God reveal to you. But to what we have attained, walk by the same rule. Think the same thing. Together become my followers, brothers, and observe those thus walking, according as you have us, a pattern. For many walk, of whom I told you about many times, and now also weeping tell, they are the enemies of the cross of Christ, whose end is destruction, whose God is the belly, and whose glory is in their shame, who are minding the things on earth. For our citizenship is in the heavens, from where we also await a Savior, the Lord Jesus Christ, who will transform the body of our humiliation to its becoming conformed to the body of His glory, according to the working of His power, even to subject all things to Himself.